A crazy creator, to say the least. Born of a drunken woman and her abusive beast. Then stepdaddy took the lead. Grew up a black sheep. Itty bitty white girl in black streets. The minority in school. Eventually, you can't ignore ridicule because you compromise. Play by the unwritten rules. Now, they're subject to change and, well, you're desperate to be cool. Freckled in the face, had a lot of extra in between the teeth space. Either exactly where you were meant to be or comically displaced. Went to 10 different schools. Seemingly unscathed. Probably never understand your own race. Back and forth between bad and good. Baptized at 11, a choice you made and understood. But home, home remained chaotic. You're still a product of the hood. You only stayed true to what you knew. You did what you could. Chose a good career path early. Had a little rough and tough in you. Never came off too girly. Could settle any argument maturely. Always, always had focus. Only true love would detour you. Now my ethnic background, <laughs> I think I'm Mexican. No black. I mean white, or possibly neither. You can stop trying to figure me out. <laughs> Obviously, I don't know who I am either. I'd rather go above and beyond. You know, be an overachiever. Though I tend to be a people pleaser. I talk to God. I know I'm saved and a believer. I can tell you that my skin color is the least of my worries. And that culturally, I've been shaped by not one race, but three. I embrace that you can't stick me with one category. I know that cool and worldly only get a person so far. At some point, you'll be face to face with who you really are. No matter how many battles I've won, I still get cut, still bear scars. I can say that true love was worth every inch of the detour. Maybe not as much for him, but it was what I was made for. And even if it hurt worse this time, I'd still be willing to give it more. I've concluded that life is such a beautiful mess, but also a blessing. And that I can't let my demons rob me of all my king created me to be. So I remain aware that morality and corruption are constantly competing. But most importantly, that each day is worth seizing.